Wisconsin-Nebraska basketball score, recap, stats, January 29, 2018. Wisconsin-Nebraska basketball score, recap. Nebraska 74, Wisconsin 63, final. Wisconsin gave away an 11-point lead in what has to be one of the most disappointing loss of the season for the Badgers. Wisconsin is now 10-13 this season, including 3-7 in Big Ten play. And the Badgers have lost three consecutive games. Ethan Happ was a bright spot for Wisconsin with 25 points. But the Badgers went cold down the stretch against a half-court trapping defense. Nebraska 60, Wisconsin 58, 354, second. Wisconsin looks lost offensively against Nebraska's half-court trap. Somebody, presumably Ethan Happ, is going to have to come up with a big play to turn this around for the Badgers. Nebraska has outscored Wisconsin 16-3 since the Badgers took a 55-44 lead. Wisconsin 55, Nebraska 52, 728, second. Nebraska is in the midst of an 8-0 run to get back into this game. Wisconsin's offense has gone stagnant and has been held scoreless over the last 231. It appeared Wisconsin might have this game close to wrapped up when it took a 55-44 lead. But nothing has come easily for the Badgers this season. Ethan Happ leads all scorers with 23 points. Wisconsin 50, Nebraska 40, 11-49, second. Aaron Mosh buries his first career three-pointer to bring the Cole Center crowd to life. Wisconsin's offense has started to get some production outside of Ethan Happ. And the Badgers are pulling away. This has been a strong second half after Wisconsin led by just two points at the break. Wisconsin 45, Nebraska 40, 1334, second, Wisconsin continues to hold Nebraska at bay. Led by Ethan Happ's 22 points and 8 rebounds. Brevin Pritzel has connected on a pair of three-pointers and is up to nine points. Wisconsin 32, Nebraska 30, halftime. Ethan Happ scores inside as the buzzer sounds to give Wisconsin the half-time lead. Happ has been an absolute star tonight. He has 18 points, 4 rebounds, 3 blocks and 3 assists. Nobody else on the team has scored more than 3 points. Wisconsin 28, Nebraska 24, 334, first, Ethan Happ's 14 points. Three rebounds and three assists lead the way for Wisconsin. But, as has been the case plenty this season, he hasn't found much help. Nebraska has played zone defense with big man Jordy Shimonga still on the floor despite having three fouls. So far, the strategy has kept Nebraska in the game. The Cornhuskers are double teaming Hap and forcing other Badgers to beat them. Wisconsin 25, Nebraska 19, 7 10, first. The two biggest ovations tonight have come for Ethan Happ's three pointer and several Badgers. Football players being introduced during a timeout. A.J. Taylor, David Edwards, Bo Ben Shawal, Michael Deiter, T.J. Edwards, and Alex Hornibrook were introduced to celebrate the team's Orange Bowl victory. On the basketball floor, Ethan Happ has 11 points. No other Wisconsin player has scored more than 3 points. Wisconsin 17, Nebraska 10, 11 50. First, Nebraska battled back to tie the score at 10 10. But Wisconsin has scored the last 7 points. Ethan Happ is off to a tremendous start with 9 points and 2 assists. Wisconsin 10, Nebraska 4, 1500, first. The biggest development from the first five minutes is that Badgers forward Ethan Happ buried 
his first career three-pointer, which drew a nice ovation from the Cole Center crowd. Hap has done his work in the post. But spent a significant amount of time honing his shot in the offseason. He has five early points, while Brevin Pritzel has three. Wisconsin Nebraska Basketball Time Game Information Wisconsin and Nebraska play at 8 p.m. CT on Monday, January 29. Time 8 p.m. CT. Date Monday, January 29. Location, Cole Center in Madison, Wisconsin. How can I watch the Wisconsin-Nebraska basketball game on TV? Wisconsin and Nebraska will play on BTN. How can I listen to the Wisconsin-Nebraska basketball game on the radio? The Wisconsin-Nebraska game is available online at WIBA, iHeart Radio. Wisconsin-Nebraska basketball preview. Wisconsin is coming off a 76-61 loss at Michigan State on Friday in which the Badgers shot just 6 of 29 from the field during the first half. Wisconsin is now 10-12 this season. And it seems likelier with each game that the Badgers could finish with a losing record this season. Badgers forward Ethan Happ missed all eight of his field goal attempts in the first half and tallied one point, but he came alive in the second half to finish with 23 points, seven rebounds and four assists. Shooting guard Brevin Pritzel added 13 points and was the only other Wisconsin player to reach double figures. Wisconsin concluded a difficult stretch in which it played five of six Big Ten games on the road. The Badgers lost all five of those contests away from home against Rutgers, Nebraska, Purdue, Iowa and Michigan State. Depth continues to be an issue for Wisconsin, which has been hindered this season by injuries to guards Demetric Trice and Kobe King. Trice underwent right foot surgery in December and has yet to return. King underwent left knee surgery and is out for the season. Those injuries have forced freshman Brad Davison to move from the off-guard spot into the point. Guard role. But Davison dislocated his left shoulder in late November. And the ailment has continued to cause problems and limit his ability to use both hands during Games. Davison aggravated the injury against Michigan State and briefly left the game before returning. He connected on 3 of 12 field goal attempts and missed all 6 of his 3-point tries. Davison, who is averaging 11.5 points per game, is in rare company as a double-digit scorer in his rookie campaign. Over the last 20 years, Devin Harris Orlando Tucker and Hap are the only Badgers to average double figures in points during their freshman seasons. Nebraska has put together a nice bounce back season after finishing 12 to 19 last season. The Cornhuskers are vying to be the fifth Big Ten team to qualify for the NCAA tournament. At this stage, Michigan State, Purdue, Ohio State and Michigan are the only four programs that are deemed as locks. Nebraska has three players averaging double figures in scoring, led by James Palmer Jr., Isaac Copeland and Glenn Watson Jr. During the team's first meeting on January 9, Nebraska defeated Wisconsin 63-59. Hap led all scorers with 19 points. While Davison added 15 points and Pritzel 10 points for the Badgers.